as for the editorial, uh, you know, we're not surprised by President Putin's words. Uh, but the fact is that Russia offers a stark contrast that demonstrates why America is exceptional. Unlike Russia, the United States stands up for democratic values and human rights in our own country and around the world. And we believe that our global security is advanced when children cannot be gassed to death by a dictator. It is also worth noting that Russia is isolated and alone in blaming the opposition for the chemical weapons attack on August 21st. There is no credible reporting, and we have seen no credible reporting that the opposition has used chemical weapons in Syria. And we have been joined by now 34 countries in declaring that the Assad regime is responsible for the use of chemical weapons on that night. Even Iran, which is fighting on Assad's behalf in Syria, has publicly blamed the Assad regime for the August 21 attack. In addition to the intelligence pertaining to the regime's preparations for the attack and our post-attack observations, it is common sense that the opposition does not have the capabilities to have carried out such a large-scale coordinated rocket and artillery attack from a regime-held neighborhood targeting opposition neighborhoods. Uh, and I think if it's, it's worth also pointing out that there's a great irony uh, that uh, in, the, in, in the placement of an op-ed like this, uh, because it reflects the uh, truly exceptional tradition in this country of freedom of expression. Uh, and that is not a tradition shared uh, in Russia, by Russia. And it is fact, uh, freedom of expression has been uh, on the decrease over the past dozen or so years in Russia. 